fighting for postseason positioning. And tonight in Omaha, the Creighton Blue Jays host the Xavier Musketeers on the Big East Digital Network, presented by SoFi. Still with plenty of punch, though, for this highly offensive team for the home squad. Uh, we are so much easier to get in at large as a member of this conference, which they have really had fun playing in. Here's a three from the left corner, and Saunders. Dumped it down to Pranger, she can't get it to fall. Neither team shooting the basketball extremely well here in the early on. There's a great outlet pass. So turnover there by the Jays led to that basket for Xavier. Ronsek from the baseline, yes. Back to basketball then. It's good, I, I, I know basketball. I know basketball, I don't know superheroes. Ren Bow. Games played and it took Creighton the third, until the third quarter to really bust through it. Here's a three for Jensen, got it. Trying to get Ronsek going in the post. She steps up and under. Man, what a scoop finish from Emma Ronsek. I like the no call. I like it when that happens, when you just let it play out. And it really was caused by the offensive player. Here. Bachelor out to Mogensen. Floater from the baseline. Got it to go. And but yeah, what Creighton likes to do is cut off of the basketball. And right now, the way that Xavier's setting up on the zone is making it tough. Even that basket right there by Bachelor was tough. Rembao, good bounce pass underneath and a reverse lay in for Ronsick. With three point shooting in the third quarter in Cincinnati, and see if they can repeat it for their hometown team here. There's an offensive rebound, and Ronsick with the free throw line jumper. Saunders wants a three. Got it. Yeah, that was a tough bounce pass on a break. Breakaway. It's tough to do that. Here's Rembao from the corner. Got that one. Molly from the wing. Got all of that one. It's gotten a lot more physical. Yeah, that's going to be to the, the benefit of Xavier as well. Here's a three for Jensen. Ooh, my. So we begin the fourth. Creighton with the basketball. Leading by nine and Bachelor makes it all just finish I mean she attacked really well but you got to be able to finish that the bow outlet Jensen wants the three got it again baseline jumper for Bachelor off the rim Mogensen offensive board put back no good Ronsick cleans it up on the other side of that coin is just shooting the basketball you don't get assists if the ball doesn't go through the net and that one goes through for Morgan Molly Great, not slowing it down at all. Jensen in the corner, wants number six, got number six. Goodness gracious. Jays move to 11 and two at home with this one. Creighton gets the 68-47 win on the heels of a tremendous fourth quarter in which they outscored the Musketeers 23 to 11. For reference, Creighton had 25 points at the end of the first half. They nearly doubled that in one quarter.